Hey guys, Mr. Light is here with a new update to my games I bought with editions for August 2018. Now, before I go over all this, because I wanted to go through, August was a rather difficult month. Started out well with a bunch of videos being sorted. Halfway through the month, I learned I actually had an infected toenail. I had to be put on antibiotics that sadly had the side effect of upsetting my tummy. I was on them for a week, suffering with a tummy ache, but thankfully my toe got better. It's a lot better now. After I came off, I got to work making more videos. I've noticed I've made some music videos. And I'm, I've also managed to finish the Let's Play of Power Rangers Super Legends. That's really good. I'm really happy I finished that because it was flipping awful. So, now that rant's out of the way, and I feel a lot better now. I got some stuff here to show off. First, I want to show off these. Now, aside from the games, I brought a few other things from charity shops that I just want to show off. First off, I went to um, one of the charity shops by me, and I got these two DVDs. Pokemon 7, Destiny Deoxys. So that's pretty good. The only thing is, I've now discovered it's actually in a foreign language. This isn't the um, American, this is um, not the English one. Wow, that was a mistake, Beck. That's a good addition because I do like looking out for things that are foreign. I thought that's good. I also got Street Fighter to the animation. I got those for a pound each. I also got the Book of Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire and Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix. That means I now own five Harry Potter books. I'm only missing the Half-Blood Prince and the Deadly Hallows. When I got those, I will have all the ones that my Mangi owned. I'm not getting The Cursed Child, because that came out after my Mangi passed away. So it's, I don't want to get that. Anyway, we got some stuff to go over. We've got quite a few games to go over now, so... Uh, let's begin with this. Got this at a charity shop for 49 pence. Let me just say, I got this because I actually wanted this for a collection's sake. Hasn't got the manual, but that doesn't matter. But even though I haven't got the console, I want to have this anyway. Disney Connect Disneyland. Yes, I did get this. I apologise for those who think it's silly of me to buy a game when I haven't got the console, but I like collecting these. And honestly, I'd like to try and get a full Connect collection of games, if I can. That might be interesting. I also got this. New Super Mario Brothers on the DS. Three pounds. And it's got the manual as well, so that is a good deal. I think that's one of my better deals. This one I got for PS4. And it is Uncharted Drake's Collection. £10. I thought, heck, that's actually a really good one. So I'm happy I got that. Uh, let's go over the PS1 now. I've got two games on PS1. Yep, got the manual. Terrific. Tomb Raider Chronicles. So I now own three Tomb Raider PS1 games. I'm just missing two of them. Got that for four pounds. Then I got this. Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. Ten pounds, but can't go wrong with that. I do think that's a worthwhile collect. Uh, so on the PS3 now. I brought... Minecraft on PS3. Three pounds for this. It's got the manual, so I'm really happy with that. I also got, yep, got the manual. The Last of Us. Three pounds. Now, I don't really like The Last of Us. I'm not really that into it. But I thought for three pounds, I can't pass that up. 
And finally moving on to the PlayStation 2. This one is a bit interesting. I'll save that one for last. First off, Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. So that's another Harry Potter game I own. That's, uh, I got that for 80 pence. And it comes with a manual. I got Haunting Grounds. Yeah, this is a rare game on the PS2. Um, a horror survival game where your helper is a dog. Come to the manual. Got that for £12, so I thought that's okay. I got the original Kingdom Hearts on PS2 to update my Kingdom Hearts library. And... Oh. Oh, wow. Ladies and gentlemen, believe it or not, Oh, it is the PAL version. Huh. Now that's interesting because... The box is not the PAL version, yet the disc... No, the box is the PAL version. But apparently, uh... The box is not in English. Okay, I got that for £8. I'm not complaining about that. I think that's a pretty good deal. Finally, this is the interesting one. I got Prince of Persia Warrior Within. Let me, hit, let me just show it now in a minute. Take both these out. Yep, there are two discs in here. There's the box Warrior Within. But in the box was the Warrior Within disc. And the Two Towers disc. So I basically got two games for the price of one there. Because it was only a pound. So I haven't got the Two Towers box, but I have got the disc ready. So those are my collections of games I've collected, along with my updates to my Harry Potter and Anime library. And ladies and gentlemen, I think that's all I'm going to say for now. I am in the middle of doing some new videos. I'm in the middle of making them. So those will be uploaded along with this, hopefully. And I'll see you guys for another video. Thank you and goodbye.